What? All right, so how do you do this? Okay, you, you spread your mud? Yep. You just want to put it fairly, you know, a good quarter inch or so. When you look at your tape, it curves out and it curves in, right? So you want to make sure your out piece is facing against your joint. Okay? But otherwise, it'll pop it out away from your wall. Take it, make sure you fold it in. Just tap it at one side. You'll see your seam because it already starts to bump out. So just keep your tape right along the seam. Touch it there like that. The straighter you keep this, the better you want it to be. Take a hop. Hold your hop right here, right tight against it, around the back. This quick drying stuff. A lot harder to work with, so you gotta. I don't know what this humidity, how well it's gonna work for me because I'm just not, not really good at this shit. Okay, so that's your first bed, right? After this dries, that's when you really worry about making it smooth. Before, the smoother your tape, the smoother your finish. So if you start out lumpy, you work hard. This shit's not as forgiving as you ever done. So clean off your edges. That's your first thing. That's your first thing. Alright? Looks good. And this stuff here, I just built up with crud. Use a little because of that. You just take your leftovers. Yeah. Don't worry about it pumping out as it, as it uh, dries and it shrinks. Go one way, you go the other way. You'll see your screws. If you see your screws, stick the screwdriver with it, just tighten them up. Okay? But with this stuff, you don't waste all the time playing with the screw holes because your screw holes will, will take a lot of time and this shit's going to start drying up quick. Alright, on the next one. That's how you do it, folks.